the Vatican is considering launching a sports initiative to coincide with World Youth Day in Madrid next year. It aims to help participants get to know each other before the event. Our work with the uh, Madrid, the, the host country of Spain, and the bishops of, of Spain who are hosting this, but to make also sport as maybe a means for different countries to get together before the World Youth Day. They have these so-called days in the diocese where uh, the youth will be gathering in Valencia or in other uh, cities uh, outside of Madrid and prior to the World Youth Day. So we hope that um, sport can be a way to kind of help different countries to, to meet. Sport and religion are two worlds that seem light years away, but the Vatican Department is trying to show that they're not as distant as many think. I think above all, if one lives their faith, uh, uh, the Catholic faith, it takes it seriously that this is going to have consequences not only off the field but also on the field, know how they play, how they act with others, how they act as a team first of all but also with their opponent. A good example given by athletes has a huge impact on young fans. With sport it's easier to transmit and proclaim values such as teamwork, solidarity and effort, values that can be integrated into the life off the field. But sportsmen I think we like to say, first of all, it needs certain human qualities, you know, and this is uh, something that sport itself could, could help. Um, you know, we often hear the buzzword of fair play or uh, being loyal, being honest, being dedicated. Father Lixi is also looking at ideas for the 2012 Olympic Games, a global event for which the Catholic Church also wants to be present.